and save. Finally, that video's done. Now it's time for me to do what I do after I upload every video. <laughs> Starting to get a little hungry. Wait, what time is it? Damn it, not again. Hey, hey, ho, ho, welcome to the show. Hey, 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 ho, ho, welcome. All right. Welcome back, everybody, to another episode of Webtooned, but we're spelling Webtooned with a U and an E now, because I don't want to keep having to go to webtoon.com. It all seems like the same website. I want, I want short and I want choppy, choppy comics, not interconnected. And I was thinking the other day, you know, who do we know, who do we know, microphone, that makes some good web comics? Who do we know who's trustworthy, who's reliable? who has a great head on their shoulders, who, who's just an amazing person. So I didn't think of anyone. So we're just going on James's website. <laughs> now, full disclosure, I was a very big fan of his comics back in the day, middle school days. That was, that was back when you had to go on Tumblr to see his web comics, not his this crazy website. <laughs> like, look at this freaking hat. I want to see statistics on who who has is, who is bought that hat. That's like the, the swag hat. But anyway, no judgments. This has nothing to do with that. This is a... This <laughs> it's just freaking three buttons. I don't know. I don't know who you made to get this website, James, but... 10% coupon. But we're not. This has nothing to do with that. Stop your... Stop your judgment, hey. people. Stop all your judgment. We're here for this little link right here. What is it? It's comics. That's right. All of all of these amazing comics, in in very in a very short, very choppy order. Very easy to see. Look, we can see these these old ones too. This isn't. I didn't watch them back then. I think 2014 or so is when I read them. Maybe. Yeah, 2014, 2013. When was I in middle school? <laughs> anyway, now we're going to look through some of these. Gonna give some ratings. I will be unbiased as possible, even though I love them as a kid. Um, we're we're very smart nowadays, though. We're really smart nowadays. We're quick on our heads, so we're gonna give some really good critiques now. Um, I can't even click on this one. <laughs> I can't click on these ones. <laughs> I, I guess she she never thought that people would click on those. I don't know. I okay. Well, fix that. So let's start off with the middle one. Let's see if we recognize any of these. Pie Day. Let's see this one. I can't wait until New Year's Pie Day because it will be 3 14 15. It will be a once in a lifetime up once and in a lifetime. <laughs> in a lifetime opportunity. He doesn't make these anymore, so I can't even give him criticism. It will be a once in a lifetime opportunity and I'll be alive to see it. Um okay, New Year's Pie Day. Next year's pie day. God, I can't even read. I shouldn't be the one to criticize that. Democracy. More like democray cray because everything's screwed up. And cray-cray means crazy. Odd one's out. I didn't think it was funny. I thought it wasn't bad. Hmm. <laughs> I mean, there, there, there are probably some good ones in here. I'm putting you under arrest for bearing arms. Who, me? I didn't do anything, honest. Oh, Miss Officer and Mr. Truffles. Bramp. All right, so we got so we got a setup, we got a diversion, and then we got the uh, the 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 thing we unexpected. That's that's a good joke right there. It's a good joke. And James, you made the officer a girl. Nice job. Nice job on that, young person James. Also, I think Miss Officer and Mr. Truffles fandom wanted to make an actual fan-made cartoon. You should Google it and see all they're doing. Oh, I guess that's a real thing. I'm not Googling that, though. Psst, 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 psst. Principal says we have to change in the parking lot now. I just don't know what that means. I don't I don't get what the joke what the what the uh what the joke is. I guess there's too much hair or Axe body spray. It's black and white, but somehow I like the colors. I forgot to color the spray can though, so accept that color. Accept that color. That was a good, that was pretty good. It wasn't that good actually. Whatever, whatever. You know what? Let's maybe, maybe this was the down period. Maybe this was the I, I tried to mate with anything. 
So I guess it would go from these ones would be the earlier ones, right? Am I right here? Am I right here? I should look at the dates. It doesn't have a date. Okay, good job this year, present. You too, future. Hey, boys. I have a friend I'd like you to meet. The ghost of failed New Year's resolutions. So, New Year's, what do you do? Uh, you didn't go to the gym twice a week. You're a failure. Dwee! My, my throat's a little shot. Shot, I can't do that, but... You know what? That was funny. I don't know why I didn't laugh, but I know it was funny. That, that were, there was definitely some, there, there was definitely, I would, there's definitely some humor in there. Hashtag no filter. That's a little funny. We're just going in here with too negative of a mindset, you know. Get a girlfriend. Ooh, I'm the ghost of failed New Year's resolution. I've come to tell you. Lower your expectations, bro. No, lower. Come on, we're talking about goals you can actually achieve. <laughs> it's a little funny. Let's hope that 2015 is life, love, and full of less anime. <laughs> Alright, that's this these are getting better. See? These are getting better. I mean, alright, let's look at the first ones. I can't click on these three again. But let's look at this one. Let's see how much improvement there is. Spider-Man isn't going to make the jump. I better eh. Spider-Man isn't going to make the jump. But he'll land on a crane, so it's all good. Dude, have you already seen this movie? Today's my first time seeing it. Little did Max know, Kevin had already gone to the 11 and 2.30 showing. What? What a joke. <laughs> is this is this actually the first comic you made? I guess this one has a date. Here is the comic where I almost gave up doing comics. I spent a lot of time making these and hardly anyone would read them. And what was the point of it all? The art's not any good and there's no way I can make a career out of this. I guess people don't like my comics. I should just go back to video games. But being a cartoonist would be so good. I could attend panels at Comic Con. People would ask me for comic advice. That would be so nice. You know, I always have dreams of making a thing, but never actually do anything to achieve that. I gave up on my YouTube dream after one video. I'll finish this comic and see if I still want to do this. Jesus. <laughs> Follow your dreams, everybody. That was amazing. All right, all right. I'm I'm inspired. I'm getting all right. I'm getting pumped. I'm getting pumped. The adorable farfetch. I wonder if these are the actual descriptions. Leaks. I was practicing my drawing, and this is the result. All right, leaks. All right, we're getting pumped. We're getting having fun. Uh, let that sink in. The sink is taking a long time to fill this bucket up. I'll just go on Tumblr real quick. Freaking cat. <laughs> Fur, furry, I guess. Little did, little did we know, even back in the day. Two hours later, how'd all this water get here? How's my anime style in the second panel? Be honest. Be honest, guys. Be honest. I don't know if that's a joke or not anymore. That's a rage comic style. It's probably a joke. That's funny. Not really. <laughs> I just keep saying that's funny without laughing. Oh no. Chug chug, whatever dude, whatever. Inspiration. You're an inspiration to us all, James. Inspiration to us all. Hard workout. Let's look at this one. Man, that workout was so hard, I wanna take a nap. I wanna take a shower. I wanna take a life. Andrew was always awkward around others. <laughs> Go, that's a little funny. I can't, I can't, this is just turning to me saying if things are funny or not. Let's analyze some actual things. The setup. There's a setup. I want to take a nap. Haha. Uh -huh. I want to take a shower. Expect it. I want to take a life unexpected. And then there's the there's the payoff. I mean, but would it have been funnier? This is advice for all comic makers though. Cuz it seems like you just kind of wanted to double dip on the joke there though. Someone if this if he could be in a comic. His name was Andrew. I hope him made him super happy. So I guess he added that panel to add Andrew in, but I don't know. It could have been funny if it just cut off I want to take a life, but would that been funny because because we know I don't know. It seemed like there was there's a bit of a double dip there. Let's let's try to find an actual bad one. Are you going to the funeral tomorrow? It's at 6 a.m. Sorry, I'm not really a morning person. Ah, your grandma's dead. We weren't that close. <laughs> 
That's pretty funny. So this this one does the same thing as the other ones. Where you think, so that's the joke. And then it's like, your grandma's dead. We weren't that close. So that, that's what makes it funny. This was Cleaver, dang it. That was pretty good. All right, hold on. All right, hold on. Serious issues. I'm trying to find one with that problem I was talking about. Come home right now, it's serious. Do you want some fish tacos? Your father can't finish them all. There wasn't, this doesn't seem like, all right, so, so this doesn't seem like this is your normal humor, you know? So what, what I would have expected, maybe this is funny because it's unexpected. I wouldn't expect you to do something like that, but I, but then if you think about it, Maybe I'm just expecting it to be funny. So maybe the expectation is 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 for you to be funny and it didn't meet the expectation, if you get what I'm saying. So what what I would think you would do, it would be like, it's I'm serious. Do you want some fish tacos? I, your father can't fish them all. And then then the character would like be at the table eating a fish taco and then the mom would be like, also I have cancer or something like that. And I'm not saying it would have been that funny, but... I think in this background is experimenting with a border and less background. And I really liked it after this comic made all my background borders less or made them not pure black outlines. That's a good tip for learning cartoonists. Don't make the black outline the same as the front outline. It'll make your characters stand out more. That's what Daft always says. But we're not here to judge the art. We're not here to judge the art. Hey babe, do you know what day it is? Valentine's Day! Ahem! I can't do a girl voice since I shot my voice. Valentine's Day? No, it's our anniversary. Our anniversary of what? Of when we broke up. <laughs> that was funny. See, unexpected. Unexpected. This is what you need to do. So what I think people do is they get into a position where they want to where they want to make an unexpected joke, but then they stop. That's not good enough for making a joke anymore, everybody. That's not good enough. We you got to be you got to then set up a set up a halfway set up a halfway like look at this one I actually really like this one so do you know what day it is Valentine's Day no it's our anniversary all right so you set up so you set up the prem premise it's like oh okay they're talking about the anniversary it's like our anniversary of what of when we broke up it's like oh th so that's a bad thing and then and then you find out they're breaking up today with the freaking heart thing that's amazing that's good good comedy good jokes good puns that's how you should make, that's how people should make this stuff, dude. My only fear about the future, as technology advances, when we travel to distant planets and visit stars we don't even know exist yet, shipping prices will be insane. 40 dollars for just a t-shirt? Well, intergalactic shipping can be expensive. See, I don't know. I guess we're ending on that one, ladies and gentlemen. What have we learned today, folks? What have we learned today? That James um, makes makes much better videos. <laughs> no, he's got... I don't know. I think that people... I know that Digby doesn't like The Odd Ones Out's comics. I, I love them. But I don't have a really good taste in stuff. So, <laughs> I, don't hold my, I don't hold my opinion with very high regard. However, I think there, I think there's some clever ones... I think that if you can, if you can lower your expectations a little bit and just have some goofs, you'll love them. You'll really like them. What's this mean for other comic makers, though? Since James doesn't make these anymore, so a very, a very big thing. It seems like when James wanted to cut short, wanted to stop the joke, was wasn't. I guess if it, I want to say not confident enough, but I don't. It's not necessarily confidence or anything. It's more like that. Okay, let's look at this one. Five more minutes. See, okay, so, so when you just want to make the two-panel comic, it doesn't. It's not as good because it's just one setup and then one anti-punch and then one, like, so the punchline is that the sheeple is an actual sheep. What I'm trying to say is that when he doesn't keep keep doing things, adding to the joke that makes it even more unexpected, and then a final diversion, that's when I think the best parts of the comic come out. And so the takeaway here is that folks who are making some web comics, and this is only a joke for the joke aspect, is to uh, is to is to not be afraid to go go big, you know, keep keep expanding on the joke. 
like you can have just having one pun isn't isn't enough for for a comic you know even these small kinds just having one set up straight hand joke isn't enough you have to be able to be like this joke but this joke isn't enough to carry it so let's add another part to it and then let's do a final diversion i don't know i think that's that's the best thing to take away from this but hey what do you think what do you think oh this is the picture you got from the that's that's interesting i was under the impression cannibals kill people <laughs> Oh, okay. So anyway, give your opinions in the comments below. Let me know if I'm, I'm offline. Let me know if I offline, off base. Let me know if I don't know what I'm talking about. Give, give opinions, give facts. And until then, thank you all so much for watching. Love you all smooches. Mwah. And I will see all you in the next video. Goodbye. Yeah, some days I feel unfazed. Like when I'm with my friends with a cut raise. Hey. And on Monday, I got a gun raise. Suicidal to a dime till hump day. Then I go right back at it like an automatic. More drinks, more songs, more beats to rap. I need a shrink, I'm gone. More time keeps passing. No watch, no thoughts at all. Just that.